girls, it's Missy Bet again. Um, so I thought today that we can focus a little bit on doing a small group activity. So for today, what we're going to uh, be working with are patterns, okay? And because we're learning about the sand and because the sand just reminds Missy Bet of the beach and water, I thought we can use colored fish, as you can see here, um, to make some patterns, okay? Um, Miss Yvette has sent this to mommies and daddies um, so they can take it out from the computer. If not, no worries. Miss Yvette's going to show you um, a different way that you guys can do the patterns with me. Okay? So um, remember, a pattern is something that um, is pretty much the same thing. It's something that repeats over and over again. Okay? So if we had two different colors, like blue and purple, um, it would repeat over and over, blue, purple, blue, purple, okay? So, I'm gonna show you um, using my colored fish. All you have to do is, when you do print it out from the computer, mommy or daddy can cut it out for you, or grandma, um, whoever you guys are staying with, can cut it out for you and you guys can do the activity, okay? So, so you guys can see it, um, I'm gonna just use a little bit of tape and put it on my laptop here, that way you guys can follow Missy Beth, okay? So the first color Missy Beth's gonna use is, I'm gonna use a purple fish, okay? And I'm gonna start here. All right, so we have a purple fish, and now we have a blue fish, okay? So if I'm only using purple and blue right now, what would my pattern look like? What do you think, what color do you think will come next? Okay, do you think it's gonna be blue? Or do you think it's gonna be purple? And remember, it has to look just like this in order for it to be a pattern. It has to repeat and look the same way, okay? So, if you're saying purple, you're absolutely right, okay? So purple is the next color in my pattern. All right, so you guys are gonna put this here. Now remember, boys and girls, this is called an A-B pattern because we're only using two colors, two different colors, okay? So now we have purple, blue, purple. Does it look like my pattern's complete yet? No, it's not. What color comes next in my pattern? That's right, blue comes next, okay? So let's see that's gonna put up her blue fish now. There we go, okay? So now my AB pattern is complete. Now you can add a couple more fish, purple and blue fish, if you like to make your pattern a little bit longer, okay? And that's okay. So now this is called an AB pattern. Now let's say you're saying, Miss Yvette, I know how to do that one already. I thought about that. So if you wanna even try to make it a little bit more difficult for you guys or a little bit harder, um, you're up to the challenge. We're going to use three different colors, okay? So I have a red fish, I have a yellow fish, and I have a green fish. So for this pattern, we're going to use three different colors. And if you're not up to doing three different colors, it's okay. I promise you will get there, okay? Just keep practicing. All right, so my first one that I'm going to do is, now this is going to be my a, B, C pattern. And why do we call it A, B, C? Because we're using three different colors, okay? So here is my red. I'm just gonna fold this and see if I can see. My red fish. Now my next color fish is going to be a yellow fish. Here's my yellow fish it's going right next to my red. Okay, and the next color is going to be green. Here we go, green. All right, so, oh, here we go, sorry about that. All right, so he um, is green. So now remember, three and the pattern repeats. It looks the same way. So it's just kind of like this. The only thing we're adding one more color, okay guys? So red, yellow, green. Which color do you think is gonna come next? Give 
if you know it, you guys can do it along with me. You guys can put down your color before I get there. Okay? If you said red, then you're absolutely right. Let me see what's going to have to shift over her fish a little bit. Okay. Now, what comes after my red fish? Let's see if those fish are trying to swim away. If you know what comes after the red, feel free to put it down before me, okay? Or my fish just went away. Oh, it's the yellow fish. Okay? And, excuse me, because my fish just literally swam away. Okay. Now, if we already have red, yellow, green, red, yellow, what's the last one? Uh, sorry guys, let's see what's having some technical difficulties with tape. That's right, green is our last one, okay? So, our first pattern, we did purple, blue, purple, blue. That's an AB pattern, okay? We can use two colors. You can also use something instead of the colors. If you wanna use maybe shapes, you can use shapes. It's all up to you, okay? Um, it doesn't have to be colors, all right? And in our th second one, we did three colors, A, B, C. So if you found this to be super easy, the A, B one, you can feel free to try. Even if you didn't think it was super easy and you say, hey, I want to try doing ABC, feel free to, okay guys? You can follow along with Missy Vet. So in the ABC, we used three different colors and we did red, yellow, green. Red, yellow, green. And remember, it just keeps going for as long as you want it to continue, okay? Now, if you can't get the fish, it's okay, no worries, okay? Because we are problem solvers here and we solve problems. If you have colored markers, I like my colors. Um, if you have colored markers or crayons, um, maybe even if you have just a pencil, you can make your own fish, okay? So you don't have to make the fish like Misty Dutt. You can just get some white paper, okay? I'm not the best illustrator, so please bear with Misty Dutt. So you can just make your fish however, I'm just going to do a little blue circle here and try to make a little fin somehow. Okay, that's that's my fish. I told you, I'm not an illustrator. Okay, so here's my blue fish. And then I'm going to get my other marker. Purple. Okay, and then I'm going to make another fish, but I'm going to make a purple one. Okay, oh, I almost messed up that tail. Okay, well, that one definitely didn't come out good. <laughs> okay, so then we have blue, purple, and just like these, what would be the next color that I would draw? It would be blue, right? So I would make another blue fish. Okay, hopefully you guys can see my little fish. All right, and then the next one would be a purple fish. You can make as many um, fish, little fish patterns as you want, okay, using your two colors. Now, if you wanted to do three colors, you can change it up. Um, let's see if that's going to use your favorite color, pink. Okay, and we're going to do a pink fish. And then we're going to do a blue fish okay this is only if you want to try doing three colors okay and then we're going to make a purple fish all right and then just looking at how i started it 
I would go back to my pink because that was the first color that I used. Okay, I'm gonna have to make my fish a little smaller so I can make them fit. Okay, my purple. Then my blue. Alright, I'm gonna have to shift my paper over just a pinch. Sorry guys. Alright. And the last color, we have pink, blue, purple, pink, blue. That's right, purple goes next, guys. Oh, Nabila just lost her mom. Her marker cap. She kept her marker. Uh, sorry, guys. Maybe my fish is very tiny now. But hopefully you guys can see that, okay? Um, so that's how you guys can do your patterns, okay? So if you don't have these fish, it's okay, you guys. Be creative. Um, and you can just draw me the little fish, okay? However you would like to draw them, all right? And of course, Miss Yvette will love to see your little fish so and your pattern. So if you can take a picture of it and send it to me, if you want to send me a video of you actually doing and following along with Miss Yvette, you don't have to follow along with me. You can try it on your own. You can watch Miss Yvette and then try it by yourself, okay? Either way, I would love to see you guys. I miss you guys like crazy. I hope you guys are doing great. And I'll keep trying to do little things um, here and there for you guys so you, we can feel like we're together. Okay, guys? All right. Mwah. Love you guys. Miss you. Um, good luck. Bye, guys.